Today we're going to try some Fan X event. I have no idea what Fan X stands for. I'm sure the X stands for exciting. So let's go and check it out. So what is Fan X? Well, I've just got it here and it seems I've matched their decor because everything is purple. I'm wearing purple. I don't know what's going on. It seems like a very intimate setting. Like it's a lot different from the bigger like Comic Cons you know of. Um, but I'm actually enjoying it so far because it seems much more quieter, which I enjoy. Let, let's go. Starting on the shop floor, I'm not going to go through every single store because I'm sure you've seen them before. However, I am going to show you ones I found cool. Now, these 3D pieces of art I found cool for a start. What you got on stand is I don't come to these places very often and I have not seen this before, so I found these pretty cool. So tell me what you do. Um, I sell literally every single anime card you could possibly find in the whole entire world. Like, just think of any anime, mate, I've got it. Neon Genesis, Sailor Moon. Fire Force, Demon Slayer, JJK, Haikyuu, honestly it goes on. We um, stream Monday to Friday on TikTok, so join the stream at some point. <laughs> um, yeah, CG cards, and my name's Corey. <laughs> now that I'm thinking of Pokemon cards, I saw these Pokemon framed cards. These are like sealed in and they are all custom made. So I think it's pretty cool that you could like just play them on the wall. They're not like really valuable cards, but I think they're really cool cards. And going by the theme of the things that I am filming, it's cool. And of course there is a TARDIS because you can't have any convention without a TARDIS or the Cyber Bus. This is always here at all these conventions. I swear it just goes around the country going to convention convention. Also, don't forget to subscribe. I know I don't tell you to subscribe very often, but I'm asking you here now. Do you, do you like this video? Then just subscribe. It's free. Like, come on, just, just do it already. So I've had a chance to walk around. Um, it, it's really hard to explain what this place is about. There are some like shops selling merch, but it's mainly about meeting the, the people that you see in the films. It's about meeting these creators, it's about meeting your heroes. And what I'm looking at here is if you have the money, you can get photos of all your heroes, but I'm not gonna show you them because you're gonna have to check their website and see who they have every year, because it does change. One other thing I will mention is, like I said, it's a little quiet, a little more intimate. So there's less time to film stuff. I mean, I wanna say quiet. Um, but overall, I would give this like a solid seven out of 10. Do you know what lay down for me is the parking. I couldn't find where to park the car. And when I did, it was like a long journey round. Again, I didn't film that because who wants to film a long journey round to the entrance? But if you are arriving by foot, there is a clear marked pedestrian entrance. This is one seriously cool stall. They do these cushions and they're made from like these arts from these films and these comics. I like that. I found that cool. Now you might be saying, I haven't done this place justice. I haven't shown everything that's going on. Well, I, I always knew I wouldn't show it justice, but I gave it my best shot. Let me ask someone completely random what they think of this event. I expected to be more people here. It is very empty. It is okay, but I feel like I have to give it like probably like a like a six or something like that. The easy way to sum this up is more like a family event. So if you were to bring the kids, it is a lot quieter, and I think they'd have a much more happier time with the. Uh, the more things that they could do. Um, but I will say, if you do bring the kids, you are going to need your wallet because they're, most things here will cost. That is just the way it goes. And they will want to buy all the merch and they will want to get all the photo opportunities. Um, they will. So I'm really trying to sum this place up and I think I figured it out. If you want to go in cosplay and you want to meet your heroes from these shows and show them your cosplay, then this is the perfect place to do it because you will get close to them and you can get pictures of them. There, there is an opportunity. Um, there are like uh, various events for like listening and, and doing panels and there's food places and there's all things. But I think it's more of a fan meet and greet if I had to sum it up into words. That is why I've really struggled to get a lot of footage of what's going on because obviously there are lots of different famous people from your shows to meet um, and you can meet them. Like you can go within this distance and talk to them. But that is the only way I can describe this place is it is a fan meet and greet. So how can we improve this place? Well, as you know, I don't just make videos. I like to give uh, feedback and improvements. One, costume hire. I don't like traveling to places with like cosplay and I don't want to have a big bag for it. So why don't we just have like a hire place where you get to the door, you can wear a costume around the place. I, I would like that personally. Or food places. I, I do like food stalls. I, I like trying different foods, maybe game foods or foods from films. That one way to do it. I guess the Fan X Live X must stand for excellent. <laughs> 